uh, I would like to show you how uh, we can use common rail injector clamping device for disassembling, assembling and repairing uh, of dense or common rail injectors. Uh, this device you can use for any type of dense or uh, common rail injectors for truck and agricultural machine like this and for any type of dense or common rail injectors for car. Uh, for truck there is a special adapter plate uh, we can attach this adapter plate to vertical shaft of clamping device install injector to groove adjust the correct position of axial clamp fixed injector with axial clamp then we can adjust correct position of radial wise touch the body with uh, flat jaw and fix the body with triangle jaw so injector is fixed now we can work with solenoid we can work with nozzle remove every part and disassemble injector. This is Isuzu injector. John Deere injector. We have two type of John Deere injector on, on the market with uh, smaller diameter of body and bigger diameter of body. For this injector we can change position of adapter plate Just correct position of radial wise. Fixed injector. Same like with Isuzu, you can remove solenoid and valve. Then we remove nozzle nut and nozzle. For bigger uh, diameter of body, we can change the position of the adapter plate. Find correct position of axial point. Fixed it. Fixed injector with axial clamp. And fixed injector with radial vice. For Hino, Kamatsu, Hitachi and Isuzu injector. We can use this grow.
you know, injector is fixed now. Same, we can open solenoid. Then we can remove nozzle. Isuzu. Injector is fixed now. Or then the common rail injector of passenger car. There is another specific adapter plate. I will show how to use it. for Nissan injectors. I can install injector to adapter plate. We can fix axial clamp. Then we can fix injector. Then we can fix the body of the injector. So injector is strongly fixed. You can work with solenoid and with nozzle. For Toyota injector, we can change position of adapter plate. and fix the body of the injector. For Ford or Mitsubishi injector. Again, you can change position of adapter plate. Injector is fixed. Now I want to show how we can disassemble injector with help of this device. For Bosch common rail injector, we can start the assembling procedure from uh, nozzle nut. Instead of Bosch injector, Denso is better to start from solenoid. So we can remove solenoid. can collect all parts in container. Uh, with this special tool we can measure valve stroke. Then we can remove valve. And with help of special tool, we can remove nut of valve. We 
can fix two. Then we can open this nut. Remove the snaps and remove valve. Remove valve nut and remove valve. Okay. Then we can disassemble nozzle nuts. Valve is coming automatically. Nozzle nut, nozzle. As you can see, there is no risk to broken pins because of axial clamp. Injector is completely disassembled. With help of this device, you can very easily disassemble any kind of common rail injector, unit pump, traditional injector, unit injector, and save the time because it takes maximum three minutes for each injector. Thank you.